People in Isleton and other parts of the Delta woke up to big shake this morning. Thankfully, there were not any reported injuries. But that doesn't mean the 4.2 magnitude earthquake didn't frighten some in the small town. I have panic. I get panic with when it comes to an earthquake. I get really like panic attacks. It's just really scary. My son's at school and just thinking about if he's OK. Or Today's earthquake comes one day after the 34th anniversary of the 6.9 magnitude 1989 Loma Prieta earthquake, which rocked the Bay Area. That earthquake killed 63 people and injured nearly 4,000 others. To avoid another tragedy like this one, the annual Great Shakeout test alert is scheduled for tomorrow to make sure you're prepared whenever an earthquake happens. ABC 10's Garish Paul Sanga joins us in studio to explain this test alert that many of us will be getting. And the way that this is timed out, Garish Paul, with today's quake and tomorrow's test, it caught a lot of Californians off guard. It certainly did, Luke. And tomorrow's test was scheduled well in advance of today's earthquake. But talk about timing and as the test alert gives Californians the opportunity to prepare, plan and learn about earthquake safety. Life saving alerts appeared on phones across Northern California this morning, whether it was the shake alert from the U.S. Geological Survey or an alert through the MyShake app developed by the UC Berkeley Seismological Lab. I had about 10 to 15 seconds to actually take protective action. People felt shaking, people got the alerts, so I would say that this was a success in our book. Success because no one was injured. While this latest earthquake was not as powerful as the ones in the past, it provided another opportunity for people to prepare for the big one. Tomorrow, around 2.8 million people with a smartphone application will get a test alert. It is part of the annual Great Shakeout. The MyShake app will issue a warning alert tomorrow at 10:19 a.m., telling people to drop, cover, and hold on for a fictitious magnitude 5.0 earthquake in San Francisco. The image will also have a test banner across it. The audio will also play alert sound, but will mention this is only a test. <laughs> Leading up to tomorrow's test alert, Cal OES went across the state offering people a simulated experience of shaking intensity up to 7.0 earthquake. Last week, they were at the state capitol asking people to stay safe. There are things above your head in your home. Think about what you can do to maybe fasten those things. Second thing is download the MyShake app. This is an application state sponsored that can give the people of California crucial seconds to take protective action. The USGS reports California has 50 earthquakes per day. While most are minor, safety officials hope you have a plan when the big one strikes. So again at 10, 19 a.m., so in about 11 hours, and this test will only apply to people with the MyShake app living in California, Oregon, and Washington. And if you want to download it, visit your app store. And like you said, Garth Paul, 50 earthquakes in California mm -hmm. each day. Better to be safe than sorry. Thankfully, no one was hurt in this morning's quake, but download that app while you can. Absolutely. Great story. Thank you.